Good by 2025 students, I know the exam season is almost coming to an end, but a lot of students had this hope on BITSAT examination. If at all you are not expecting that great college or branch through, you know, JE or any other common entrance test. But uh, that came as a shocker, especially in BITSAT, where there are a lot of issues, glitches, delays, and I'm just showing you all the problems uh, which happened in the first session. Like, you know, uh, in the admit card and everything, it was told or basically the rule book, it was told that when you mark a question for review, you will be able to come back. Like that option is there and many of you are used to it in the mock tests which we have. But that option was, only, was not there. Just imagine the panic that it would have created because now you have to think of how will you remember to come back to this question if I have to, you know, solve it further. Then... Some students also reported that they had to scroll a lot to see the entire thing. Mainly also the issue was regarding images were too much zoomed in or maybe too small or too big. This was another issue. Also, some of the maths symbols were missing or sometimes the symbol were loading. But after a lot of time, some equations were missing. Sometimes I think even in English or logical reasoning somewhere, some underline was missing. And after a lot of time, it came. And also timing delays, like lot of time was taking for the questions to load or even the exam to start because there was huge rush lines. Sometimes even the biometrics caused an issue. The server was down. So, you know, the exam got delayed. Some of the centers also reported some invigilator issues that they were causing some disturbance and stuff like that. Or even sometimes the fans, the ACs, etc. whatever were not on. So, see, these were the problems in session one. So, I don't mean to scare you, but these are the reality. And usually, BITS used to conduct this exam really well without any issues. Everything used to go smooth and it was a very good private deemed university, guys. I mean, uh, it was looked upon like as uh, at par with J Advance. So, what to do now? Okay, first of all, see, a lot of students have sent mails, everything. And if you open up the BitSat website over here, okay, like the BitSat website, they have not mentioned as such anything, whatever issues happened. They have just told beware of fraudulent calls here, that, that, this and that. And uh, tomorrow is, by the way, the last day to apply for the session number two. Yeah, 10th of June. So I hope you have applied by now. But in case you have not yet, please apply it by 10th of June. Tomorrow is the last day. So officially, they haven't mentioned anything as such regarding you know, the uh, 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 issues. Also, many students complained that their score, what they were expecting is not what it was because the answers did not match as per their expectations. There were a lot of errors in the questions or answers itself. Yeah. So now what to do? This is very important, guys. And please share this message across everyone because lakhs of students, not thousands, lakhs of students are dependent on this. And if every private institute starts doing this, then it will set a wrong precedent, wrong example for other colleges because BITSET was the supreme standard. So then every other examination will be like this. Then what will a student look for? No, NTA also doing something. This is also doing something. So we need to go somewhere. And if everywhere some error is there, then we can't have our admission based on luck. Okay. So, first of all, spread this message by liking the video. If you have not yet liked, please like this video. Don't, don't panic and stay calm. A lot of students panicked in the hall or outside. Parents were shouting. And when you see your parents shouting and you are shouting, some other students shouting, you are thinking, you are getting frustrated in your head. And when you enter with that mentality inside the hall, even if there was no problem, your mindset is screwed up. Your mindset is gone. So, yes, some people might do it because, yes, that frustration will be there. But you try to compose yourself. Okay. Don't try to uh, create unnecessary drama over there. Yes, there will be some issue. Maybe. But I am really hoping BITS manages it well, especially for session two. 
and if something happens what else to do i'll tell you second thing please go early don't expect just they have mentioned half an hour or one hour before so i'll be there no be there even before finish off your biometrics finish off your registration signing whatever just enter the hall as soon as possible so at least you are on the computer on time don't be late because huge rush or lines were also seen at some centers okay please see where your center is make the travel arrangements properly keep a track of your time and proof don't expect whatever time is shown as remaining is actually remaining please see actually if there is a clock just ask the invigilator please see tell me in your watch what is your time just keep a track of time suddenly some clock stops working in that uh, timer i don't know because there were many technical glitches sometimes the exam starts late see nobody is going to listen to you so the exam started late what should i do there is no proof so you have to take a proof how will you take a proof you have to record sir but camera phones are not allowed what to do ask your parent or your friend who is outside with the phone record it see this is the time this is the center stand in front show the parents two three parents see our kid is inside and still they are outside or whatever they are not able to start the sessions or something if whatever video proof you can gather please ask your parents to be alert and let them do the recording the phones won't be with you ask them to record from outside whatever they can if at all they can record some proof okay maybe some small thing and then we will use it because now in session 1 there was not any proof it was just parents and students word of mouth whatever please don't expect that option of reviewing yeah because if in the session 1 it was not there hopefully it comes but go with the mindset that it will not be there so what will you do if let's say you want to review question number 12 write it down in your rough sheet somewhere question 12 or just write down 12 in one corner or keep a space for review and then come back to that question okay just make that as a habit even during your mock test okay we cannot expect that it may come agree or disagree okay if something is missing let's say some symbol something is taking time try to skip to the next question okay try to go to the next question okay if at all possible if that is also getting stuck then please call the invigilator and ask the invigilator take a video of this right now take a video of this right now see my system is getting hanged you ask for your right that is your right that the question should load on time if every question one one minute is wasted imagine some 10 20 questions 20 minutes gets wasted who will give you that seat is it didn't your loss invigilator will just come and go away nothing for him to lose ask him that it is your right that you have to record okay he it is his duty he cannot say that oh no no nothing like that ask him tell him hold his hold him accountable any issue ask your parents to record and really hope and i really hope that bits manages it well and the most important thing please give mock test see the mock tests are covering many variety of questions a range of questions you are also getting a hang of you know how to solve these many questions because it is not like je means many questions are there your speed should be good and please try to complete the mock tests at least 15 to 20 minutes before the scheduled time expect that there might be some delay some server crash some loading issue just mentally make a issue and see how you will perform in the mock test so that in the actual day you are mentally prepared i just hope nothing happens but see that is why you should remain calm and not become very anxious and all of that and if you are asking sir where can we get the mock test it's there in the description box of this particular video only i'm giving you all the 10 mock tests for a very nominal price of 450 rupees you can click buy full test series it's got all 10 mock tests at a very affordable price same type of questions which are asked in bitset variety of difficulties are there so that you can practice on your own and you know please don't use the review question option and sometimes you can use sometimes don't use because you don't know what is going to happen in the actual test we just hope we just hope that everything goes well and bits management learns their lesson okay and if you are with me that yes bitsat should manage it properly please share this video across to all your friends smash that like button and uh, do let me know 
if there was any other issue which I have missed, which was there. And if you feel that there was any other issue during session two, please come back onto this video or, you know, we'll definitely let you guys know and keep you guys updated. So stay subscribed. And yes, make use of this test series with the test analysis to improve your scores. Everything that is there in your hand right now, use it because BitSat is your last weapon which you can use to grab a seat. Don't give up. I know you are frustrated, you are fatigued by now giving so many exams, but just few more days, guys, you are done. You are sorted. Once the seat is there with you, then you will be in command to choose your branch to go to your dream college. So once this all nonsense is done, you know, you will be in the first year of your engineering college and you want to be in the best college. So give it all that you have. Okay. Don't stay back. Don't hold yourself back and give these mock tests. Okay. Thank you so much, guys. This is your Captain Shreyas.